everywhere tense, confused, frightening, and disturbing. But here we are today. I mean, if they had told us last week, Sunday, that we'll be here to celebrate Ayodeji's life, we'll say it's not possible. He was ill, no doubt, but we're believing God that he'll be well. But here we are right now, and there he is. And of course, a lot of you know that I really shouldn't be here, but that's how life is. That's how life is. Two o'clock this morning, I received a call that shattered my life, but life must go on and here we are today so i've just come to speak to us very peacefully on something i have called life 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 is a deep mystery life is a deep mystery there's no one human being, no matter how wise they are like Solomon, who can say to you that they fully understand life. The Bible says we see in part, we understand in part, we prophesy in part. And it says most of the time we see like in a dark alley. But there's going to come a time when we we'll see clearly as Jesus sees. Life is a mystery. And let us accept the mystery of life. I was telling some people, I think yesterday or maybe today, the days have gone back in a twist, that uh, we don't have any control over most things in life. You know, you don't have any control. You don't have any control on how you were born, who gave birth to you, when you were born, through whom, whose womb you came, your complexion, your race, your color, the color of your eyes, your height, and even very limited control over your weight. Some people struggle with their weight. They eat little, they grow fat. Some people eat much, they grow thin, and they are all confused all over the place. So nobody has control over life. If this time yesterday, anybody would have told me that today will be the way it is. I say it's not possible. How can it be possible? But this is how life is. This is life. This is how life is. Life is nothing. Life is nothing. 